God, I am such a cucker. We're back! Last time, we defeated a giant head. And we walked back. I got a seed of resilience. Alright, do you want to see how many seeds I have before we continue on? I'll show you how many seeds I fucking have. Here we go. Four seed of resilience. One seed of wisdom. Two seeds of agility. One seed of life. One seed of magic. And one seed of strength. Pay attention to those numbers. Those numbers are going to be fucking huge by the end of the game. Trust me. And I will listen to Vegister accordingly. And Vegister, you really think Street Fighter 1 is the only fucking fighting game I'm going to play on this channel? You are sorely mistaken, my friend. <laughs> the games I'm going to play, there's barely a fucking easy mode. <laughs> That's why I believe some people want to come to my channel, see me rage, and see the bullshit. That is of SNK uh, boss syndrome. If you really want to see some old ass fucking rubber banding, you haven't seen the fucking SNK games, have you, Lot? You've never fucking seen those games. <laughs> those games. Oh boy, let me tell you. <laughs> it's got some huge ass rubber banding. And there goes one of my fucking mother's alarm clock. And I believe she's awake now. I've been I got distracted watching videos. There's a reason. Uh just I'll explain it. Because if I take these meds that help me focus, you know. Uh fuck. Give me a minute. There's a name. If I take my focus meds, I don't fucking get sleep. So, I'm not taking them, because I want sleep! <laughs> if I take it later, I don't get sleep, so that's why I've been staying up at 11. Now I wouldn't fucking wonder why. So I didn't take them, so I can go to bed early. <laughs> Wake up early. So, because we're taking those fucking mess in it. Yes, guys, Toast is still asleep. He needs to get his ass up. That's what he needs to do. He doesn't even fucking take fucking focus meds. Fucking asshole. <laughs> this week's gonna be fucking crazy. So I'm gonna try to record as much Dragon Quest as I can. Also try to get as much homework as I can. I, I have a whole fucking thing planned out. With deadlines set accordingly. But. I'll be doing Animal Crossing, Swap Note, and Dragon Quest now. Ah. Street Fighter 1's finished, so I really don't need to fucking, uh, play that game again. Because it's already done. I did everything that a game I could. Remember, guys, there are some things I will not be able to accomplish. I just do... I just take the advice that my mother always told me. Do the best I can. And that's why I do. That's why I try to make these videos fucking stupid and funny. Because I want people to remember the journey... Rather than the completion, because if this was just some boring ass fucking completion, then why the fuck would you even want to want to fucking watch this video anyways, right? So, I tell you some hints, I tell you some important stuff that I need to tell you, but I want to make the thing as funny as possible. Alright, you fucking furry, alright, let's fucking bring it on, you fucking asshole, let's go! Let's fucking go, yeah, I mean, fuck you. Fucking monster ass furry. Giving the fucking fur, fur community a bad name. You fuck boy. Anyways. I'm not a furry. I'm not anything else. I just... I just don't say shit about them. It's what they believe in. It's what they want to believe in. Go right ahead. I don't give a shit. Just don't fucking push your agenda on me. And I would be okay with you. Just as long as you fucking push your agenda... You'll still have my respect if you push your agenda. Well, uh, that's a different, uh, that's a different story. But uh, that's a story that I won't go into. Okay, if we fucking continue, fucking keep walking. Come on, you fucking little shits. Come on, we have to save fucking Emberdale. Don't got all day. Come on. Wish there was a run button. God, why didn't they put a run button? Everything's. Ugh. 
And there goes my mother's phone. I have to fucking wake her up, do I? I always end up doing it. Also, when you wake up my brother so he can fucking bring his stupid dishes down. He fucking hasn't. He's making me pissed. Oh, you did it. You got hold of the stuff I told you about. Of course I did. I think Uncle Pike would fucking give me this shit. You must be dumb. Now then, let's not lock up about an empty that bottle onto the flame and see what happens. Here we go, guys. Use the bottle, the holly wally water into the flames. Ugh. Yay, we saved the village. That's the stuff. Well, would you look at that? It's gone. I that the ink crikey for that. If you lot hadn't stuck around till the bitter end, we have been in the right pickle. Look like me vision won't be coming true after all. You sure, Palma? I I can feel it in me waters. No more eruptions for us. Thank crikey for that. Right, everyone! That's quite enough excitement for one year. I hereby declare the ritual over. Now let's get back to Umberdale and put the kettle on. This calls for a cuppa. Try, you and your pal saved our village. That's why I'm making you our guests of honor tonight. You'll have a time of your lives, I promise. See you back there. It won't be the first, and it certainly won't be the last. Oh man, I like this story, there's just so much shit you have to do in order to get to the fucking ending. Oh, the fucking special, special thing I have to do. It takes so much fucking time and so much effort, but it'll all be worth it. <laughs> Having successfully completed the return of the fire ritual, everyone makes their way back to Emberdale. A lavish party is held with singing, dancing, and merrymaking, and the fear that was not felt on the mountain is soon forgotten. Dry and friends have a final time surrounded by local and well-wishers, and plenty of tea and sandwiches. And by the time the festivities came to an end, the sun is already in the sky. Morning! Eh, what a night that was! I just want to say it, say it to you for all your help and have a safe journey. We don't have enough gold, so oh the town music, I fucking love the music. I love everything in this game. It's just the fucking conditions, bro. Pain in the ass. Don't need that copper sword anymore. I don't fucking need it. What do you have? Nothing for fucking Maribel. Fuck you. I will find Maribel goddamn better equipment later in the game. Fuck this shit. Moment. Hmm? Oh, it's you! Looks like you you had a hand good night's rest. The people in this village owe you a lot, you know? So I've been thinking we should somewhat say a thanks. I had a quick gaze into my crystal ball to see if we are out that might say used to you. It happens we do! Here. <laughs> Sorry for being loud. Sorry! <laughs> Forgive me! <laughs> Forgive me! I held on to that thing, it might come in handy when, when I were telling fortunes. But according to me, old Crystal Ball, you'll get more use out of it than me. Don't be strangers now, eh? If there's ever old, old panel I can do for you, drop by for a cuppa and chat. I think that's English. I think that's British. I'm sure. English, British. Okay. Now, I'm going to stop everything in my devices. There is something important that we must do. See this here? Turn the camera around. Where's that fucking kid? Where's that kid?
Where the fuck is he? Don't tell me I fucking missed it. If I fucking missed it, I will be pissed. Don't fucking tell me. Do I have the fucking reset? Where's the little shit? Where is he? I'm sweating my ball. Where the fuck's this little shit? Um, supposedly there's a fucking event going on in this fucking town. Oh, god damn it. I fucking missed out, did I? I missed it because I went to go see fucking Palma. Fucking shit. I'll look up my sources. I'll see you all later. Peace. Remember, stay crispy.